to the channel. I hope you're doing really, really well and having a lovely day. So today I thought I'd come on and do a little Primark haul. One day last week I had a child-free day, so I popped along to my local Primark and had a really, really good look around with no children and no interruptions. I managed to try some clothes on. I managed to swatch makeup. It was so, so nice. I managed to fill one of the really big bags full of goodies. I've got some clothing items, some makeup bits, some dupes that I've seen all over TikTok and Instagram, some accessories, some children's bits, lots of different items. So if that's something you're interested in, then please continue to watch. I'm not going to do this in any particular order. I'm just going to dive into the bag, pull out the stuff and show you what I picked up. The first thing, which is right here, thought I'd quickly show you and get it out of the way. So it is this little bucket and spade and accessories um, set. So this is obviously for my daughter. It's not weather appropriate right now. It is freezing cold. We are back to like a minus one weather, which I am over. It's like the weather teased us a few weeks ago. It felt like spring was on its way and it was getting warmer, got all excited. And now, yeah, it's just freezing cold again. But anyway, thought I would pick this up whilst I saw it. This was only £3.50. So you get the big castle bucket like that. And then it's got some little um, accessories in, some um, shapes, spade, a rake. Yeah, it was only £3.50. They also did this with like blues and greens, but Elsie chose the pink castle. So I picked it up that for summer. At least we know now we have it. And um we won't have to try and find one when it does actually get hot. So the next thing I picked up, like I said, were some makeup bits. I put them all in a separate little bag so I wouldn't lose them. I have seen all over Instagram and TikTok, Primark have so many dupes of different high-end makeup brands. Um, so I thought I would go in and see what I can find. My store didn't have loads. It's been really, really picked over. Like I said, it's all over the internet. Um, but I did find a few. So I thought I would show you. So the first ones that I mainly went for were these. So these are a dupe for um, the Charlotte Tilbury. Not sure what they're called by Charlotte Tilbury. But these ones from Primark are the PS Pro Cream Blush and Cream contour so they just look like this so they're just little ones and then on the end they have a little sponge applicator as you can see i've already used this so yeah like i said i picked up the contour and a blush they also do it in a highlighter which they didn't have in my store so the contour i got in a dark brown i'm not sure if they have any other colors of these that's all my store had and then i got the blush in a pink they also had it in a peachy color but i thought i just pick up the pink i have tried both of these they are really really nice i don't know what they're like in comparison to the charlotte tilbury ones because i've not used them but they blend really nice um, they have good pigmentation. They're just really, really nice. These are £4.50 each. So a little bit more than what you would pay for this sort of thing in Primark. But like I said, they are a dupe. So um, yeah, if you are heading to Primark, definitely check these out. They've got a whole range of Charlotte Tilbury dupes, like lipsticks, um, lip liners, lip glosses, eyeshadow palettes, but I didn't have them in my store. That's all I could find. So I picked up those, like I said, they're really nice. And then this is another dupe. I'm not actually sure what for, but I thought I would give it a go. So it's the PS My Perfect Color Illuminating Foundation. Just looks like this. It was £6. I usually just use the Rimmel one, which is about £9 or £10 now. Um, so for £6, I thought we would give this one a go. It is in the colour, well, I got it in the colour Cashew, which is number five. Seems to be a really good match. It's a really nice foundation, actually. It's an SPF of 20 as well. So, yeah, it's nice. Um, I wouldn't say it's like the best foundation I've ever used, but it is a nice foundation. If you do know what this is a dupe for, let me know in the comments. I know there's one for a NARS dupe. I'm not sure if it is this one. If it is, I'll let you know. But, yeah, um, pick that one up. Like I said, it's a nice foundation. So, yeah, got that one. Next thing I picked up were the PS Highlighter Drops. Just thought they looked really, really pretty. Those were £3, so it's just got the little drop applicator i don't know if you can see on camera but they are really iridescent and shimmery they're really really nice i haven't tried these out yet 
Um, I'm gonna give them a go on my birthday. I don't really wear highlighter day to day just for like going to work, but if I have like a night out or something like that, I will use it. So I'm gonna give that a go, see what it's like. Let me know down below if you've tried any of these items and what they're like. But yeah, I thought that looked really pretty. So I thought I would pick that one up. Next thing I picked up was this mascara. This is also a dupe for something, which I'm not sure. I've really done my homework here, haven't I? But I have used this before and I know it's good. So I thought I'd pick it up. So it's the So Extra Mascara. This one was £2.50. It's a really good mascara. It's very dark. It's got a fat um, wand. So if you're interested, because some people prefer a thin wand, this has got a fatter wand um yeah it's a really good mascara and people are raving about this all over instagram so definitely check that one out if you're in need for a new mascara next two things i picked up aren't actually dupes or anything i thought i'd just pick them up so i saw this so it is a limp lip plumper um lip gloss bit of a backstory to this i tried this on sunday when i got it it does work it has like that tingling effect it does plump um, slightly, but it's made me come out in a cold sore. I have not had a cold sore for months and months and months. My lips have been really, really good. Tried this the other day, and then the next day I came out in a big cold sore. So it might have just been the tingling effect of this. So I can't use this, but if anyone else wants to give it a go, I, um, it is really good. So this one was £3. This is in the clear shimmer. They also did a pink shimmer. Um, yeah, it does what it says, but it just doesn't work for me, obviously, because it breaks out my lips. But yeah, picked that one up. And then the next thing I picked up were some uh, fake nails. I work in a kitchen, so we're not allowed nails. We've just got to have short nails, no nail polish, no acrylics, absolutely nothing, which I, I hate. Um, so I thought I would pick these up to wear on my birthday. These are the latte ones. They are the coffin mat ones. They were only a pound. So I thought I'd give them a go. I've seen people rave about these. I've never tried them. You get 24 nails with glue up to seven days where I will just be having them for the one night, like I said, because I can't have anything on my nails, but I thought I'd give them a go. I really like the shape of them and the colors, quite like a nude color. So yeah, I picked those ones up for one pound. Next thing I picked up, I actually needed, but I wasn't sure what type I was gonna get anyway. So I picked up this little rucksack, backpack, whatever you like to call them. So you can tell on camera, but it's like a slight gray color. It's a really, really pale gray. It looks even lighter on camera. It's a little bit darker than that. It's got silver hardware. Um, I was looking for a black backpack, but I didn't have any that I liked. So I picked up this one. Obviously I have a four year old um, and when we go on days out, I always like to take a little rucksack. It just makes it easier to put it on my shoulders. I have my hands free for her. The one I have at the minute is quite small and it doesn't hold much. Um, so I thought I would get a new one. This is a really decent size. It's not too big. I don't didn't want like a massive, massive one. So it's got one big compartment inside and it's got a little pocket inside with a zip and then it has a big pocket on the front. It also has the two sides like this for drinks and water bottles, which is great. I hate putting them in the bag in case they leak, but this one has little side ones and then it's just the standard little straps on the back with a little handle. This one was only £9, so I thought it was a bit of a bargain for a little rucksack, like I said, just to take on days out. I'm gonna take Elsie out, but yeah, I picked up that one. I thought that was really, really cute. Next thing I picked up were some gift bags. So Elsie is huge into unicorns at the minute. It's her new thing. She's requested a unicorn birthday party. Bear in mind, it's not till August, but she knows what she wants and she really wants unicorn theme um so she asked if i see any unicorn bits can i pick them up so i found these in primark and i thought they were really really pretty so i found this one first which is more her style the rainbow the bright colors so it's got a little white gift bag with a little unicorn face on and then a little horn this one was one pound 30 i am aware you can get gift bags so much cheaper i usually get them in home bargains for like 69p but it's a unicorn and she absolutely loves it. And then I found this unicorn one, which is more my style, more of the muted pastel colors. 
just looks like that and this one was also £1.30 so picked up that to make a start on her little birthday unicorn theme party so yeah picked those up in on the theme of unicorns I picked up one of these this is actually for Elsie's friend she's been invited to a little birthday party from her school so I thought this would be a really good little gift so it's an art set so you get the little folder that you can reuse and then inside you get a colouring pad um, some stickers and some colouring pencils and this one was only £3.50 so it just looks like that I thought that was a really good little gift they were all the accessories and makeup bits I picked up the next items are all clothing items so the first thing I picked up I have actually worn so it hasn't got tags on but it is this little ribbed top so they have these in so many colours in Primark they are super stretchy they do them in different neck styles, different um, sleeves. So I've got this one, which is like a high neck sleeveless kind of cropped one. They do it in a t-shirt style. They also do these now in v-necks. They are so, so comfortable. I don't know if you can tell, but they are ribbed. Like I said, they are so stretchy. I got this one in a medium, which is a 12 to 14. It fits really, really nice. They also do the matching um, cycling shorts of these. So I might get some of them for summer. I thought I'd just pick up this first and see what it's like. So, so comfortable. I think this was only four pound. Um, like I said, they do them in so many different colors. I just went for the black, but I think I'm gonna go back and get some more because they are really, really nice. So yeah, definitely check these out. They are usually on the tables with all the folded up bits. So yeah, check these out. They are a very good staple to have in your wardrobe. Very, very comfy. Seem very, very popular. So yeah, definitely check them out. If you're in need of some new um, little tops or you can use it for gym wear or anything, they're so versatile. So yeah, got that one. Next thing I picked up was this little top it's very summery but my head is now like I said over this winter weather this one was seven pound I got it in a small I haven't actually shown you it yet have I so it just looks like that so it's this kind of beige color with the black stripes the straps look like that it's a v-neck and then it just goes down like that it looks absolutely tiny on the hanger I thought it was really really small I nearly did size up but I tried it on and they stretch really, really well. They are so, so soft and comfortable. I absolutely love this. I thought this would just look nice in the summer with some little black shorts and some little black sandals. I just thought that was really, really nice and it's given me like H&M vibes. I don't know why, like I said, it was only seven pound. I think they do this in different colors now. I've seen a few people share on Instagram, but my store only had this color so I'm definitely going to get some more if I see them like I said they're very very comfortable they look really nice on and yeah very deceiving like I said stick to your true size because they've got good stretch but I thought pick that up I really really like that one so talking of summer I picked up some of the basic black Primark flip-flops I get these every single year whenever I see them I grab them I must own like three or four pairs a year because they do wear quite quickly but they are only not 90p anymore gals a pound i know it's only 10p but these have forever been 90p with inflation they've gone up to a pound but yeah so i picked up a pair of these like i said always have them just a basic pair of flip-flops for the summer go with absolutely everything have them in hundreds of colors different styles and designs but i just went for plain boring black Another staple I always pick up when I go to Primark are these little cropped vests. These are actually pyjama tops. That's how they're sold in Primark. But I think everyone now wears these as like a normal top. These are only £3.50. They are super soft, super stretchy, super comfy. They've got this kind of ribbed effect in them. They have got adjustable straps as well, which is brilliant. They are double lined on the front. So they've got like a little built-in bit on them which is really good they are really really flattering they do these in so many colors I've got the black I also picked up the white which I cannot find I might have put it away but yeah black and white I got £3.50 these are perfect just to wear under sweatshirts or if I just want to put them on with a pair of leggings they are really really comfy so yeah definitely check these out like I said they are sold in the pajama section but they definitely are wearable as normal tops so next thing i picked up i'm not 100 sure if i'm gonna keep i really really like them so 
basically it's my birthday in a few weeks time i'm going out for dinner and drinks with my friends and i wanted something different to wear so i thought i'd pick up these and it's a little squat so it's black like this so it looks like a skirt on the front with the little slit there and then it's just shorts on the back really really like these these were 14 pounds got these in a size eight they also had them in a creamy beige color but i thought i'd just pick up the black it's really really hard to see it on camera just thought they were a really nice staple piece to have and then i picked up this little shirt blouse to go with them um this i really 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 love i really want to wear this i'm going to see if it works with the shorts oh my god it's super crease from being in the bag but it's this little satin white blouse so it just looks like that it is cropped it's long sleeve and then the sleeves look like that on the bottom like that it is so flattering on like i said i tried it on in store and i absolutely love it got this in a size eight it was 11 pounds got a collar that looks like that and then it's got just little buttons down the front like i said it's a crop style it is so flattering on flattering on it is like a looser style it's not super tight anyway i just really really love this so i picked that one up for 11 pounds and then i'm thinking of wearing it maybe with the score and then maybe a blazer i'm not sure i'm going to try them on together and see what i think so i thought that would look really really nice they have got loads of shorts and blazer sets in primark um loads in like spring colors got some nice blues some pinks some pale green so if you're in the hunt for some little sets like that definitely go to primark and have a look because i've got absolutely loads next thing i picked up was something a little bit different but it was just a sweatshirt and it's this gray one with mickey mouse on i just love the simplicity and the classic style of this jumper they have so many disney um items in primark especially now with the disney 100 100 range but i just really like this one it's this really nice gray color as well so it's not like a really garish color it's very wearable i just thought i could just wear that with leggings i got this in a medium which is a 12 to 14 i like to go a few sizes up with sweatshirts because i like them to be oversized and baggy like i said so i can wear them with leggings so yeah i picked that one up it's really really soft it was only nine pound like i said they have so many different ones this was actually on the tables um, and they have loads of others for nine pound as well but yeah thought that was really really nice so i picked up that one this next item is technically underwear it is sold upstairs in the underwear section but I thought this could be worn as a top. So it's this little lace number. It's very hard to show on the camera. So it's got a little high neck and then it just looks like this with a cutout detail in the middle. And then it goes down like that into a body. Like I said, I'm planning on wearing this as a top. It has got little adjustable straps like that on the back and it has got an open back. I thought that'd be really pretty tucked in to some nice um jeans or shorts with a blazer as you can tell i love a little top and blazer combo this was 12 pound it is in the primark collection it says but yeah i just thought that would be really nice as a top rather than underwear i just thought it was really pretty for 12 pound i just love this cutout detail and the lace and the little sleeves I thought that was really nice so i picked up that and then the last thing i picked up was for elsie um they do these types of dresses every single year and i always get them for her and they are absolutely beautiful and this one has to be my favorite of all the ones that i've ever bought so far so it's this little white dress so look at this it's absolutely stunning i love dresses like this in the summer when she's got like a little tan and some little sandals on i just thought it was absolutely adorable it's got these big puffy sleeves and then it just goes a bit tighter in the middle and then goes out again like that it's got this like ruching on the back which is elasticated i absolutely love this one this one was 12 pound i'm sure last year they were 13 pounds so this is actually a little bit cheaper than what i thought it would be just thought that was stunning they do also do this one in a pink and they do a few other designs but this one i thought the classic white was beautiful and yeah absolutely love this i know i'm mad putting white on a four-year-old but yeah 
just thought it was so so pretty and she can wear it with so many different like sandals and little hats and I just can't wait for summer. So that was everything that I picked up in Primark. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It lets me know that you've enjoyed this type of content and I can make more. If you're not subscribed, I would love to have you here. It's completely free. Just push the little red button and then you are subscribed to my channel and you get to see my videos without having to search for them. So thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoy the rest of your week and have a good one and I'll see you all in my next video.